What's up, guys? I'm back. The day after unboxing video, there's another one. Now, this is the game that everyone at GameStop was wanting to get. Everyone got. There's like six or seven people in front of me, and then four or five more came in behind me. This was not at a midnight release. This was when the store opens. They had two people there when the store opened. That's smart. So what game is it? Fallout 4. And yes, it does say right there. Very, very, very close. Xbox exclusive offer, Fallout 3 for free. Wow. I'm guessing because of the backwards compatibility is going to be coming up and Fallout 3 could be on that list. So You got basically the same as the other. It's just the dude with the mask. But I'm excited to play it like right away, but I'm not. Welcome home, Bethesda Game Studio, the award-winning creator of Fallout 3 and Skyrim, welcome you to their most ambitious game ever and the next generation of open-world gaming. Technically, it's not the first open-world game. It could be. Well, it says next generation, it doesn't say the first. I would think, like, Saints 4 is, but that was originally a different as the sole survivor of Vault 111, alright, that kind of spoils something, you enter a world destroyed by a nuclear war. Every second is a fight for survival, and every choice is yours. Only you can rebuild and determine the fate of the wasteland. And it comes with a Vault Tech Perk poster included. Hmm. Probably put that up there somewhere if that's a smaller one. I still gotta, I still gotta fix the one above my head. Uh, freedom and liber freedom and liberty. Do whatever you want in a massive open world with hundreds of locations. Collect and build. Collect, upgrade, and build thousands of items in the most advanced crafting system ever. You are S P E C I A L special. Be whoever you want. Choose from hundreds of perks and develop your own play style, which is awesome. It's, a, it's not a game where you need to do this, this, and this. No, you can play however you want. It only has forty gig, up to 40 gigs, which isn't bad. So these two, the two games, Tomb Raider, should download like fairly fast. If you get the digital version, it takes a lot longer. I downloaded a 60, 50 or 60 gigabyte one that took like two hours. So Best of E3 2015, I believe. Some of that. It has a bunch of awards thing I can't even read. Ready in for blood and gore, intense violence, strong language, and use of drugs. So here's what's probably going to happen if it's a, if it's basically just a a copy of Fallout Three. I'll probably give it to a friend or a friend or something because I already own Fallout Three. I got the Game of the Year edition. Okay, come on. All right, but. This game is very, very promising. I've seen previews of it. I've seen... I had to watch a gameplay of it to know whether or not I'm actually going to, you know, actually, actually get it. But... We'll see. When I mean actually, actually get it, because I was skeptical. It's like, I like Fallout, but the controls and stuff are kind of iffy for me. Alright. Is it... A, it a, yeah. Where is it? It says... Hmm. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's a download code. Huh. <laughs> Vault Dweller Survival Guide. <laughs> yeah, it's just the controls and stuff. Is this... What is this? That was an Xbox One controller. Yes, it was. It's basically a... I guess Xbox 360 code. But... Oh, God. I don't want to show that. I have that face in the wrong way. I don't want people to see that online and like get the copy, because I'm either going to give it to someone or use it for myself and have a digital copy of it. But here's the game itself. It's basically a vault with the center of it in it. And let's... Let's look at this little, uh, oh god. It's a full on, actually it might be a full on poster. Nah, it's just, it's a, it's a small poster, but it ain't going up there. 
<laughs> it's basically <laughs> it's pretty cool looking. I have to like zoom in here. Shows your strength and then the levels of your perks and stuff like that. It's pretty neat. Vault's life has its perks. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. Alright, I'm not going to be able to get that back in. Because it's going to be a little bit before I actually deal with it. Okay, there it goes. But, thank you all for watching this unboxing video of Fallout 4. I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly will enjoy the game. Um, I could do a let's play of it later down the line. Because I can now. <laughs> but, hope you enjoy it. See you next time.